What's up, everybody? It's Jonathan from Indegan Photos. Omar and I are here waiting for the elevator because I am about to go on top of a building for this project, the old Texaco building downtown. So we're still sitting here waiting for the elevator and we should be going up here shortly. And I got all my equipment. So we can do some cool, like, rooftop shooting especially for this project. Get some good aerial views and stuff like that. But right now, I'm gonna send you over to a video that I shot when I was on top of another building. So check that out and I'll be back in a minute. Hope you enjoyed the little video montage I put together. Uh, right now we are on the top of the Texaco building. We're on the first roof. There's another roof, as you can see, over there. We're going to go up there in a minute. Um, my job here today is just to get some more footage of the building. It's still hot in Houston. God, it's hot in Houston. It's about 91 degrees and then like 99% humidity. But anyway, the job today is to get some more footage. Um, from the building to give that perspective of like the views and everything that you'll get to see. It's gonna be time-lapse footage. And as you can see, here's the rest of the back end of downtown Houston. Got a lot of action going, cars moving, construction behind us. So, should be a really cool time-lapse. Got some pretty clouds, so a lot of movement. So that's the first thing I'm gonna to do today. I'm gonna to do a time-lapse up here. I'm gonna go ahead and set up, uh, do a little panning and should be a pretty cool time lapse. I'm gonna go ahead and set up, I'll let y'all see that. What's up? Now that I've got everything set up, just give you an idea of my vision for this time lapse that I'm taking right now. So I've got the beautiful downtown, as you can see, and my job has been to shoot this amazing building in its resurrection. So it's old Texaco building in downtown Houston. So I've captured pretty much everything happening as it's been growing up for my client. And right now I want to get kind of like the perspective that you'll get if you were to look out a window in the back part of downtown. So I've got the A7R2 with the Canon 24 to 70 connected to my Kessler second shooter which is a three axis pan tilt slide. And I'm doing time-lapse footage, just sweeping across the back as if you were, like my concept for it is, pretend you're looking out the window and you're just like, wow, what a great view. And that's what I'm trying to get from my client. And hopefully it turns out pretty awesome. Um, I'll have a clip of it at the end of this video. And uh, I think after we're done here, there's actually a second roof to this building. So let me walk over here. And if you look up, we've got a second roof up there. So after I'm done with this one, Omar and I are gonna go up there and get some more footage. In fact, I'd really like to get footage of the crane swinging. That's what's cool about this one. I look for like multiple pieces of action going on in my time lapses. And this is what I love about this one. So you can see cars, the construction workers down there, people walking, and the cool thing is these three cranes, two there and one over there, and then there's a fourth one, are all moving. So we'll be able to get that action too. 
So it should be really cool. Oh, and plus the action of the slide and the, uh, the panning and the tilting. So that's gonna add even more movement to it. So it should be a pretty awesome looking, cross our fingers, uh, clip here. And we'll get to see part of it at the end of this, end of this video. So talk to you in a few, probably go up to that roof and then I'll explain my concept there. What's up guys? So I just finished taking that footage up on the roof uh, as one clip. It's really hot in Houston, super, super hot still. Um, 91 degrees, but with the humidity, it's probably over 100, especially being on a roof. So I just wanted to do one clip today. I'm gonna go home, render it, see how it looks. Um, one of the issues I think that I might have is that it looks like in that construction site in the middle, the guys decided to go to lunch. And that happens sometimes. It might look cool, it might not. That's just one of those things. Um, what I plan on doing though is, oh shoot, I think the elevator might be coming up. Finally, that's what you have to wait for lots of times on construction site. But that's kind of part of the thing that I want to do with these videos, show you um, the ups and downs, the fun things that you learn, have to learn on the spot of doing a big construction gig like this. Been doing it about five months and it's been going pretty good. Uh, learned a lot and now I'm gonna force myself into vlogging daily when I'm up here, just so you can see what's going on. So tomorrow I'll probably come up. If I don't like the shot that I shot today, we'll look at it at the end of this video. If I don't like it, then I'll reshoot it. And then we're gonna get a couple other things. I think I wanna also get, you can see the parking garage that they're putting in. I usually shoot across the street from that garage. Um, I think I'm gonna get some alternative footage though. Get them from the top up here on down. So that should be really kind of cool. And a couple other things. And then probably, what's today, Tuesday, Thursday, I'll be on the garage across the street and get that. And then I think they're going to be doing some window stuff too this week, so I need to capture that. So it's going to be a busy week. We're also, uh, wife and I are going to go to Colorado this weekend, so I'm going to take y'all along and we're going to do some beautiful landscape type time lapses that I love to do. Um, we were in Utah and Arizona two weeks ago, but it was just such a hectic schedule. I wasn't able to get a lot of video. Well, we're going to change it up now so I can get <clears throat> y'all to see a lot of the things that are going on. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see y'all tomorrow.